people know that the company started with one man in a shed and it's grown to what it is now. My earliest memories of JCB probably are, are really my father. The story is well known, but he really did start with him and two fellas. He was full on about business from a very early age and with me being with him. The best thing about JCB is we're always trying to push forward. I like to get stuck in. The oil cap here and uh, you get a good living out of it. This is just a world-class organization all the way around. It's the people, it's the product that we produce, it's everything we touch here at JCB. Right at the heart of the approach that we're taking, of course, is the customer. The customer is, is crucial to us. We, we live and die by our customers. JCB is not afraid to invest and do the right things at the right time, especially for our customers. We strive a lot for customer satisfaction, and that is why the customer wants to keep coming back to us. You can have the best product, you can have the best price, you sell once. But the second time is because you look after your customer. And I think, you know, that's the essence of our business. We understand the needs of our customers. Since I was a, a youngster, I sort of never grew out of Tonka toys and always loved um, backhoe loaders, the JCB. I started my own business when I was 16, driving a backhoe loader. So I understand what it's like to drive machines, how important it is that they keep the uptime and the quality of the machines correct. JCB is unique in the fact that we manufacture our own cabs, uh, drive line, being the axles, transmission, and the engines, and even the hydraulic rams. So we work very, very closely and control the design of all those parts, which is unique to JCB. No other manufacturer has that amount of manufacturing and investment uh, in those areas. Fast track is very different to a conventional tractor. The really revolutionary thing about fast track is its full suspension system. So it allows our operators to be more comfortable, more productive, and get far more done than a conventional tractor. I've been working for JCB now for just over 17 years. Just started on the line and progressed up to doing the final audit. JCB strive quality, quality, quality all the time, and, and that's basically what JCB is about. I've got 251 checks plus, I do the tests on the test track, test the hydraulics and everything else. The biggest satisfaction I get out of my job is making sure the customer uh, ends up with the perfect product and it will come back to the company and buy another one. JCB is extremely committed to the environment and sustainability field uh, as a whole. We've introduced a new app for two distinct reasons. One is to demonstrate to our customers the fuel savings that they can achieve and also the carbon saving in relation to purchasing a new 3CX Eco, 4CX Eco or 8085 Eco. This machine is actually 21% more efficient than the nearest competitor and also 21% more productive than what the nearest competitor is. At World Port Centre, we're dispatching 30,000 lines a week. We can get an order out remarkably fast here. We can ping that order out and prioritise it to a certain picker and get it into the process and get it packed and delivered super quick time. Oh, hi, this is Amy from the Customer Experience Centre. In the Customer Experience Centre, we have two main objectives. Firstly, ensuring optimum machine availability through monitoring of machines that are fitted with our live link system. And secondly, we progress any issues that are raised as part of our customer satisfaction survey. So whether it's good or bad feedback, we try and get that sent over to the relevant business unit or the relevant dealer to make sure that we can carry on doing the good work or that we improve something so that another customer doesn't have the same experience. It's very important what we send to the customer. We want to send a very good machine, defect free, leak free. We do a number of checks on the line to ensure this happens. We also have real-time, live-time feedback, so 
so faults are fed back to the area as and when they happen. We call this quality control stage one. The advantage of this is we, we throw a significant amount of light in so that the operator can actually see what he's checking. This process has made quite dramatic improvements because it gives us immediate feedback of any problems. It's irrefutable really, it improves the quality dramatically. Quality is very important to me. Uh, I take a lot of pride in my work. As I come across problems, I don't like to just go around them. I like to solve them, make sure they're just happening again. We're proud of the, of the equipment that we make because what we do and what we start off here in the welding shop and the manufacturing area, that's what's passed on to the assembly line and to the end user. As you drive down the motorway and you see one of the JCBs actually working, at, working on, the, on the roadside and that, it just makes you very, very proud that you have something to do with that machine uh, and that it is a JCB. We have today over 370 sales and distribution outlets spread across this vast country. The dealerships are family business as well and they appreciate when we work with them together and I think that's a huge strength that we have in remaining as close to the customer as is possible. The dealership was started by my grandfather. It was a very funny start where there were no agreements, uh, no contracts signed. It was just uh, that a representative from JCB told us that uh, why don't you sell a machine and let's just take it on from there. And that's the way we started in 1984. In 87 we sold our first machine and uh, we got the highest uh, sales All India Award for selling 11 machines. And last year, 2010, we got the highest sales again, All India, for selling 1,100 machines. So from 11 to 1,100, that's a massive growth that we've seen. And investing in a facility like this will get us returns. Being with JCB for three generations now, since 1984 till date, I think our blood is not red, it's yellow. It's the JCB colour that runs in our veins. In the last year, May and June, we were making five engines in a month. And now, this is within seven or eight months, we have grown that much that now we are making 100 engines in a day. Pune Fabrication Plant is the largest fabrication plant amongst the group uh, worldwide. And we are the backbone for the Balabgar factory, who is the largest manufacturer of the backhoes in the world. And also, we are supplying the parts to heavy line business unit in Pune. So within the infrastructure, then it's very important for us to ensure that we have trained sales and service technicians who can then provide support to the customer. Every machine we sell almost has three to four people working around it. You have two or three operators and you have helpers who later on aspire to be operators. If we sold 21,000 machines last year, this would need at least 42,000 operators. We've created the India Design Center, and hopefully this design center will grow into a group design center, which will enhance the way in which we develop products in terms of quality, but very often, time to market. The family is different at JCB to anywhere else. And that's because I think at the heart of it, of course, it's a family-owned business. I think it gives a lot of pride to the people that are working here. And I think that runs right down to the shop floor. I have a number of employees who have uncles, aunties, brothers and sisters that work in JCB. I am working here the last 30 years. My daughter is working here in the finance department. The team is my family. It, it's, it, they're not employees, but they're, they're my family. The commitment, drive and passion are what it's all about. JCB is a family-owned business and uh, I'm proud to be part of it. I really am. Brazil is one of the most exciting markets you can think of. I mean, everything is coming together from the World Cup to the Olympic Games, offshore oil, 
huge investments infrastructure. I mean, you can hardly think of a country that is more full of opportunities than Brazil. We started building backhouse here in this plant in 2001. The growth has been dramatic. I mean, the market on average has been growing like 30% and we've been growing like 70% in all these years. So it's been really outstanding. Five years ago, we sold 100 machines in one year. After this, we sold 630 machines. It is a fantastic number and a fantastic history. Another big milestone for us was last year, in 2010, when we started building excavators. The market keeps on growing, you know, and we have to grow with that market. And the only way we can do that is with a new facility. This new facility with 32,000 square meters in a plot of 200,000 and the state-of-the-art technology will be the tool that will allow us to maximize the full opportunity of Brazil. If I had to sum up JCB in one word, I would say family. Great. Design. Positive approach. Seria excelência. Powerful. Innovative. Passionate. Worldwide. It's high standard. Excellent. Exciting. Fantastic. Quick. Challenging. Go, 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 go. Fantastic. It's dynamic. It's dynamic. Dynamic is the word. China is one of the biggest construction machinery market. It counts over 50% of the overall world market. At the same time, it is the most competitive market as well. All the big players in this construction machinery industry, they're all in now in China. And so to be successful in China, you have to be very, very competitive and to be a local player. Construction machinery work in China in a very tough situation. I worked seven days a week, 24 hours a day. So this needs machine be very good quality and very reliable. Since 2006 until now, our dealer network almost doubling every year. And now we have uh, 30 dealers and 110 outlets and most of this dealer has been with us less than a year and they've been selling now over 100 units a year. So it is a very successful story because of strong support from JCB. The compaction equipment is a fantastic complementary product to the products of JCB. Uh, which have been produced since many, many years. And now JCB is giving us what we have been missing. We are the compaction experts, but we need in markets. JCB is really helping us in all respects of our business. From a sales and marketing point of view, and this is my responsibility, uh, we have received a lot of help in terms of market research. Our engineers are part of the global engineering network now. And last but not least, JCB has a second to none dealer network. Uh, which is very well capable to sell our machines in the markets and to service them afterwards. We have grown since JCB has acquired us in 2005. Since then we are heavily increasing our business again and JCB Vibramax will have a fantastic future. I can't really explain why I enjoy my job. I, I just do. If you're prepared to work after JCB, then JCB We'll back you 100%. What do we have to do? It is absolutely great to work for JCB because they have given me a lot of responsibility at a very early stage. They respect you as an individual and give you that responsibility to, to blossom and to uh, grow your own career. To me, the best thing about working for JCB is how quickly you can make decisions. People don't question you why you've done this or why you've done that. Even if I've taken a bad decision, it's taken to be, you know, it's a decision and it's taken fo forward from there. I learned how to work in a team, the best team I've ever seen in my life. JCB mein team ke roop mein kaam karne ka hum sab ko bahut garav hai. Das Beste daran, für JCB zu arbeiten, ist zum einen der Kontakt zu Menschen, verteilt über die ganze Welt. 
I think one of the best things about working for JCP is the ability, the freedom to do what you think is right. I've been told a million times by the deputy chairman, ask me to say no. And most of the time, you'll find he actually says yes. JCB has allowed me to do what I do best, and that is help customers figure out what machines they need for their specific jobs, and then help our guys and gals sell them. I think it's terribly important that wherever we employ people, that we put back in the area. It's my wife that has started this whole process round the world, and she believes very strongly in it, as, as the family does. Ninety percent of the students come from very poor families, and they don't get much help from their parents. We have a aim to make this village a model village. 100% literacy, 100% children going to school, and good health and hygiene. This is our target. The best thing of, about this school is our teachers. They tell me that we can do many things in our life. They are so, so supporting. I want to become a fashion designer. I want to become a writer. I want to become a business woman. I want to become a teacher. The JCB Academy is a new venture that we've got involved with. Um, principally because in Britain there's a real shortage of, of engineers. The government has got a program of starting academies, but we're the first engineering academy. And we have young people, students that join us at the age of 14. So they're already in secondary education and go through to um, 18 or 19, uh, where hopefully they go on to university to, to do engineering. I want to be a motorsports engineer when I leave. I want to work in the pits and the cars sector, so like rally cars. To be a motorsports engineer, you have to be able to communicate well, work in teams, and you have to have good engineering-based knowledge. The things I like most is the engineering, really. Being down the workshops, actually getting to make stuff. It really helps students to be able to retain what they've learned if they can be immersed in a situation. And we have such fantastic facilities here. It allows us to create many, many different scenarios, different experiences for them. Savannah as a location for JCB has got a number of benefits. Transportation, uh, a healthy work environment uh, are all pluses and the main reason why we chose to locate here. It's just a phenomenal plant to work for. It's a, it's a great people, great environment, it makes you proud. The US represents one third of the world market for construction equipment. So our opportunity to grow here uh, is substantial. The US represents 60% of the world market for skid steers. So six out of every 10 products sold in this country are actually skid steers. It was one of the reasons for designing and engineering a new range of products here. In fact, 18 models on the Series 3. Uh, range of products. So it makes good sense for JCB to be successful is to design and engineer and manufacture the product here for the North American home market and export elsewhere around the world. Uh, the public launch at Con Expo in Las Vegas in March of this year was just, let me express it this way, 40 years with JCB I have never seen such a reaction to a product as we've seen from the new skid steers. We've had the opportunity to take uh, our new generation machine around to several trade shows, and I had the opportunity to, to be at one of them in Louisville, Kentucky. I was there one afternoon when a farm family from Illinois came in, and they had a disabled son. He was in a wheelchair. And I went over and started talking to the father. I said, have you seen our new machine? He said, not really. I said, I want to show you something truly unique. 
and I took him over there, and he wheeled his son over there, and I opened the door of the skid steer. And it was like a light went on over the, his head and the, and the young man, and I explained to him, I said, people do not have to crawl over the attachment on our machine. I said, you simply open the door like you would on your car or truck and get right in the machine. And I said, our low effort servo controls, you can operate the whole machine with your hands. And the young fella started getting tears down his face. And he understood that JCB cared enough to have a design of a machine that he could operate. And the young boy said, Dad, he said, I can be part of the family, I can help. Go, a little spin in the hemi. Go in here and show you some of the maneuverability. Crab steering. A little bit of a drunken sailor walk. Should have been an ice skater. Yeah, baby, yeah, let's go. Some of the most significant achievements of the high mobility engine excavator, and the ones we're the most proud of, is the fact that we've added crew protection to the machine. That crew protection has saved two soldiers' lives, one U.S. and one U.K. Both will return to duty after significant events the day after with no injuries. Well, our military is always out taking care of us, protecting our country. You know, it's just nice to build a machine for them that uh, protects them as well. The only thing that stops you in JCB is you. You want to progress in JCB, you progress. The JCB motto is Jamé Content, and it literally does live by that motto. What we're looking for is as close to perfection as possible. We produce a good machine, it's the number one in the world, so we can't be doing too bad. The future is certainly yellow. I tell my parents that I'm working in JCB, they're like, they're proud of me. So I feel very good about working here. They've looked after me when things probably wasn't you know, as good as they are now. Um, it's a cracking company to work for. The culture is really very good. And when several employees going home, they carry a big smile on their faces. In the 32 years that, that I've been here, uh, you still feel part of the family. You, you feel as new to the company today as you did 32 years ago. My family are enormously appreciative of, of what people have done for the company. The company is nowhere without the people in it. From the core of my heart, I feel very proud to be a JCBN. Family's sorted, house is sorted. It's, it's a great firm. Uh, 